Life can only be understood backwards, but it must be lived forwards. People demand freedom of speech as a compensation for the freedom of thought which they seldom use. The function of prayer is not to influence God, but rather to change the nature of the one who prays. Anxiety is the dizziness of freedom. People understand me so poorly that they don't even understand my complaint about them not understanding me. Life is not a problem to be solved, but a reality to be experienced. The most common form of despair is not being who you are. The greatest hazard of all, losing oneself, can occur very quietly in the world, as if it were nothing at all. No other loss can occur so quietly. Any other loss, an arm, a leg, five dollars, a wife, is sure to be noticed. I see it all perfectly. There are two possible situations. One can either do this or that. My honest opinion and my friendly advice is this. Do it or do not do it. You will regret both. The most painful state of being is remembering the future, particularly the one you'll never have. What if everything in the world were a misunderstanding? What if laughter were really tears? To dare is to lose one's footing momentarily. Not to dare is to lose one's self. The tyrant dies and his rule is over. The martyr dies and his rule begins. To venture causes anxiety. But not to venture is to lose oneself, and to venture in the highest is precisely to be conscious of oneself. Face the facts of being what you are, for that is what changes what you are. God creates out of nothing. Wonderful, you say. Yes, to be sure, but he does what is still more wonderful. He makes saints out of sinners. To cheat oneself out of love is the most terrible deception. It is an eternal loss for which there is no reparation, either in time or in eternity. If anyone on the verge of action should judge himself according to the outcome, he would never begin. The highest and most beautiful things in life are not to be heard about, nor read about, nor seen but, if one will, hard to be lived. Many of us pursue pleasure with such breathless haste that we hurry past it. It is perhaps the misfortune of my life that I am interested in far too much but not decisively in any one thing. All my interests are not subordinated in one but stand on an equal footing. It is so hard to believe because it is so hard to obey. Boredom is the root of all evil, the despairing refusal to be oneself. One must not think slightingly of the paradoxical, for the paradox is the source of the thinker's passion. And the thinker without a paradox is like a lover without feeling, a paltry mediocrity. It is impossible to exist without passion.
There is nothing with which every man is so afraid as getting to know how enormously much he is capable of doing and becoming. It is the duty of the human understanding to understand that there are things which it cannot understand. Happiness is the greatest hiding place for despair. Hope is a passion for the possible. The task must be made difficult, for only the difficult inspires the noble-hearted. The only intelligent tactical response to life's horror is to laugh defiantly at it. The present state of the world and the whole of life is diseased. If I were a doctor and were asked for my advice, I should reply, create silence. In my great melancholy, I loved life for I love my melancholy. To be lost in spiritlessness is the most terrible thing of all. Now, with God's help, I shall become myself.